Uh, the Japan Airlines aircraft, aircraft uh, crash. Five out of six crew members uh, on uh, the Kaiko aircraft uh, have, uh, have died. Uh, the Japan Airlines uh, plane uh, which ca caught fire. Uh, five out of the six crew members on the Japan Coast Guard plane have died, according to uh, the Metropolitan Police Department. This is what uh, uh, the police department is saying. In addition, the captain was seriously injured. Uh, a fire, in fact, broke out in a plane on a runway at uh, Japan's uh, Tokyo Haneda Airport. Uh, the public broadcaster, NHK, uh, they broadcast uh, this footage that you can see on your screen. Flames uh, could be seen coming out uh, of the windows of an aircraft. The fire may have been caused uh, by a collision between, uh, it was indeed caused by a collision between the plane and uh, the Japan Coast Guard aircraft. And these are uh, the live visuals of uh, rescue operations that are taking place. Uh, at uh, the Haneda Airport in Tokyo. Uh, uh, Tokyo Fire Department uh, uh, had basically uh, said uh, the Ministry of Land Infrastructure, Transport and Tourism. Uh, it also said that uh, it is probing uh, this collision on uh, the runway. And uh, these are uh, all the visuals that you can see on your screen of uh, the plane that caught fire. Uh, uh, the plane that caught fire while, uh, take, uh, while on the runway uh, we can see on the uh, on the left uh, of your uh, screen uh, the plane. You can see the plane uh, coming down uh, with fire. There was a there was a collision. Uh, rescue operations have been uh, going on for uh, some time, uh, and uh, uh, five out of uh, six people on that Coast Guard plane have uh, uh, have died. And uh, uh, and uh, the. The police department, the Metropolitan Police Department, uh, has informed and said that five of the six people on that board, uh, on board uh, the Japan Coast Guard fixed-wing aircraft, uh, were uh, confirmed uh, dead. And uh, these are the latest uh, visuals that you can uh, see on your screens, uh, coming straight from uh, the Haneda Airport in Tokyo. And uh, I'm joined by uh, my colleague Vishal. Uh, Vishal. Uh, what are the latest uh, developments uh, that you can report right now? Because after the earthquake, Japan seems to be hit with another tragedy now. Well, Osama, a major tragedy has been averted uh, in this uh, plane accident. So the plane landed and burst into flames as uh, the reports suggest that it collided with a Coast Guard plane that was delivering aid for the earthquake that struck Japan yesterday. So it should be noted that around four dozen people died in that uh, quake so that plane was delivering aid for that and uh, it uh, collided with a plane that was incoming that was coming from Hokkaido in Japan uh, it burst into flames as it, as it landed uh, thankfully all 379 people on board that passenger plane were evacuated uh, experts are praising the evacuation operation as all the crew and the passengers escaped certain death uh, but the uh, other aircraft involved in the uh, accident uh, did not uh, uh, have the same fate as five out of the six crew uh, met their death and uh, uh, it's been a tragedy for them. Uh, they were delivering aid for people who were affected uh, uh, by the earthquake. So we'll have to wait uh, to see uh, what kind of injuries the people on that passenger plane have uh, uh, gone through. Uh, there could be smoke inhalation injuries, there could be burn injuries. We'll have to wait and get confirmation on that. Vishal, uh, has, there, has there been any information on uh, what, what could have uh, gone wrong? Uh, uh, was there a communication issue? Uh, is there any sort of information coming in? That's what uh, all of us are wondering. Like, uh, uh, it's one of the busiest airports in Japan, probably one of the busiest in the whole continent of Asia. Uh, how this miscommunication happened, uh, there are such uh, high-grade equipment uh, on these uh, airports. Uh, air traffic control is in touch with air, airplanes all around their uh, routes. So uh, two big planes uh, on the runway colliding on Tokyo's second biggest airport. Uh, is uh, making people wonder what went wrong but uh, there are no uh, confirmation as to what exactly went wrong but uh, uh, a major tragedy averted. Vishal Vivek, thank you very much for uh, all those details.